When I started the Through My Eyes series, the very first topic I discussed was how I found and started VRChat. And at the start of that video, I discussed how I stumbled upon a video uploaded by someone called Pokelols, who found Evolved Ant, a very popular character from my YouTube videos. They had a moment where Evolved Ant played Kiss Me, which is something he's done in my videos as well, went in for a kiss, they were about to kiss, and then somebody, literally, her name was Somebody, not in the video, but we met her in VR as well, under the name Somebody, went in and cocked blocked the kiss. I had gotten home from college, and that video popped up on my YouTube in my recommended, even though I never watched anything about VR because I didn't care about VR, I didn't watch anything anime. In general, it was not a video that made sense to be in my recommended, and it was the only video in my recommended like it. I was just gonna skip over it, but I decided to click on it thinking, eh, this looks cringy and stupid as fuck. Let me go ahead and click it and watch it. And oh my god, I loved this video. I had never seen the eye tracking like this before. And that's what it is in VR chat. You can make your models so that their eyes track sources where other players are viewing from and also make them look around and blink a little bit. It's something you set up or now these days it's something someone else sets up and it's just already built into models you find in the world. VR chat has changed a lot since then. But back then this wasn't really a thing you saw in many games and it certainly wasn't a thing you saw in a chat client, especially not on this one rare person that has a custom model whereas almost nobody else has a custom model. Like I said when I first started this series, I must have rewatched this three dozen times or more. I showed it to all my friends and I ended up buying VR just shortly after that, after trying VR chat out for myself. There was another channel I watched a lot of to actually make my decision to buy VR, but right here is where the story branches. Now, back when I first started this series, this is where I branched off to talk about buying VR, my first day in VR chat, and how I got into it during those days that I was trying it out. Today, I'm going to branch in a different direction and talk specifically about Evolved Ant. This video is all about Evolved Dance how I met him, what he would become to be in my videos, and any interesting behind the scenes information that I can provide. Now one thing I feel important to provide to you before we really get into the nitty gritty here is what exactly made me get into VR chat wasn't just this one video, there was another channel called VR chat moments that posted a whole bunch of videos of just anime girl characters doing cute and funny things. And I'll play an example of one of these videos for you. This one's called Kissing an Anime Girl in VR. <laughs> you were, you were big, oh my god, You're this back. is some weird hentai shit right here. Hi, welcome to weird hentai shit. If you haven't already, set low commission to classic and turn off personal space. Oh jeez, that's a bit close. Oh no! No! What did I witness? Please kill me, where's the bleach? Who had well, the bleach? Uh, you're a little quiet, you turn, turn your mic. Why? That's the first time you see two uh, girls still, coming still really close. I can't hear you over anyone else. No, uh, actually, the trap. <laughs> <laughs> They're probably traps. Um, traps yeah. everywhere. Yeah. You might want to set up. Um, hey, dick, make it Windows better, in, in dude. In, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. This one is his full mic, so it doesn't have that option. I swear, if you do another one of. Uh, no. Yeah. Okay. No, so, yeah, no, no. That's a pretty cool tank. Please, effect. no, this is. Nice, nice. I, I like the wait. But... Yeah. <laughs> we will creep you all, this yeah. dude. <laughs> Please, no. Oh, so God. Is. No, 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 please. Like the, what? No. Usually I say turn the outline down, but this is like, this, I'll go this actually looks really nice. So it doesn't looks a little bored on It's a tree cement. I want to be really weird. Do I look like I have? I watched every video that this channel had uploaded to that point before making my decision to buy VR. And when I got into VR, there were three individuals that I actually really, really wanted to meet. One of them was the owner of VR Chat Moments. I honestly forget if I've ever met him. I don't think I have. 
Number two is Sir Doge, Doge, I don't know how to say his name, but he was in the video that I just played. I did end up meeting him, I think it was off camera, and it was actually not very special at all. And number three was the guy from that very first video with Pokelols, Evolved Ant. I was really hoping to run into him eventually, since he got me into VR, he got me into VR chat. His video is what opened my world to a game that would not only affect where I live right now, but also affect what I do for a living. And in November of 2017, I finally got the chance. It was a pretty average day in VR chat. I was hanging out with my friends, we were world hopping, and we found ourselves in the hub at the time, now known as the old hub. Evolved Ant had entered the world. I knew he was there, but I kind of kept my distance because I didn't want to go up to him and be some kind of creepy fan. Like, oh my god, I saw you in that video, I thought it was so cool. So I just minded my own business, I stayed with my own little group, and suddenly, everyone started looking at me. Hey, hi. How you doing? Hi. How's your day? I'm good. good, how are you? Yeah, how, how are, are you? you? Oh, that's good. That's good. I mean, you know, welcome to VR chat. I'm not new. Yes, you are. Shut up. Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> Diversion. <laughs> I feel like I'm being pranked right now, like, what is this? Evolved Ant was pulling another one of his little funny acts as the Pink Panther coming up behind me with the sounds playing, and I had my volume a little low, so I barely heard it anyway. Everyone was trying to distract me in order to get a reaction out of me, especially when they saw how I reacted to the first time. In the middle of all this, Matt9 showed up and this was actually a day where we got a lot of good footage from Matt9. This was only like my second or third time ever seeing Matt9 ever. And he of course demonstrated his characteristic lewdness, which still lives even to this day in real life. He started projecting that energy towards Evolved Ant, and the silliness went on from there. Hey it's Wait Matt9! Uh, Matt9! We Matt no nine. Matt9, we went over this. Oh. We went over this. We Matt Nine's got your back. See, I trained Matt Nine well. Did you like clone Matt Nine from Matt Six? I no, I found Matt Nine and I trained I trained Matt oh, Nine. Okay. You don't we, we, Matt Nine. Matt, look behind you, Matt Nine. <laughs> <laughs> My sound effects off for a what bit. What are you doing? Whoa, man. Oh my goodness. Music is he And during this, one of the best parts of the whole video and one of these recurring things in my videos happened where Evolved Ant changed into this weird, scary, like, demonic-looking character with a horror sound effect going on and started chasing me around, and me still being new-ish to VR and the world and everything around it just being so, I don't know, immersive, like you feel like you're there. I was fucking terrified. I just started running my ass away, and this ended up becoming one of the favorite parts of the whole video. I can see with the beast. I can see with the beast. Uh-oh. And he's dead. What the? What? <coughs> wow. You were oh. a cute, tiny tiger? You monster. <laughs> I was being kind. You monster. I was actually oh, really- guys. What the guys. Oh, what? Play someone. Someone. What? Don't do it. Don't grab okay. it. No, That's wait. too late. Oh! 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 What? No, I didn't touch it! I didn't touch it! Hey! <laughs> No one touched that. No one. Are you crazy? I'm out. I'm leaving. I'm running. Oh sh. Oh sh. Oh. Oh no. Hello. Oh no.
He's coming. He's coming. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Next victim. <laughs> At nine, I'm scared. I titled this video. Rosola meets his VR chat idol, and I put Evolve Dance name in the title, and up to this point in the video, we're almost like halfway through, I still haven't explained why I would ever dub him VR chat idol. That comes at the end. And all you really see to this point is him playing pranks and messing around. And at the time, this actually became my most viewed video ever. Up till this point, my most viewed video on this channel was all about Matt Six, and I covered that in a previous video in this series. I was actually gonna throw the video away, but I chose not to. Posted it just to see if I could do anything with Matt Six in the SEO of YouTube's algorithm to try to get some views, and it did. It got up to like 40,000 views, I think, and definitely set me on the track to actually being able to do YouTube and post VR chat videos more often, but this one, this one was the first one to ever hit 100,000 views. And now it's been surpassed by, I think, at least a half a dozen videos now, including one that's around 300 or 400,000 views by this point. Right now, it's sitting at 166,574 views. This video was one of the most important videos for my channel, revolving around the person that was one of the most important persons for my channel. And even though it's not in that number one spot anymore, its popularity and the effect that its popularity had, I think should be noted when telling this story. I also want to point out that this video actually had a glitch during my rendering process. I don't know what I did because this never happened for any other video ever, but pretty much every scene transition in the video has a fade to black and then fade back into the video. Don't know how, don't know why, but this is the only video like that. And the reason is because, I don't know, I must have pressed a wrong button or something or the render fucked up because it's just all over the video. Anyway, now that I just story dumped you, let me show you a couple more of Evolve Dance shenanigans. Ed, can you send me the audio search for that, please? Yeah. Please. Thank you. <laughs> Matt 9, get him! Matt 9! Matt 9! Matt 9! Matt 9! Matt 9! I can't hear the music. I don't want to look back. No. Accept it. No. Oh. 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 Is that thing making that noise? Oh Jesus. <laughs> are, you, are you gotta be kidding me? You gotta be kidding me! <laughs> you, you gotta... Okay, oh, that's boy, normal. That that's that's normal. That's good. What? What? Excuse me. Oh, dang it. What? What? Oh, oh. Right, I need okay. to grab something from there. I need to grab something from there. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. What is this? What What the hell? What? Oh, oh, that. Oh, great, should, this one. Should I move? Pray Satan. Should, should I, I should I? Move. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, you can turn it. You can turn it. No, no, Jesus. <laughs> this whole time, all these shenanigans are going on. One thing to remember on the inside, I'm just fangirling right now. The person that got me into VR, who I didn't even realize just how important he would be to the development of my life in the future was here in front of me and giving me all this random exclusive attention and now actually by the point of the video that i've showed you he actually left the world for about an hour and then came back that's something that i don't actually really communicate in that video but when he does come back after these pranks are kind of moved on he comes up to me and he starts offering me a truce hug okay truce 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 hug Truth, oh, truth hug is. I'm gonna trust yeah. you. 
I'm, I'm, Let them have no, a Matt oh, Nine, whoa, whoa. Matt Nine. I said choose hug. Matt, Matt Nine, I'm gonna trust him. I'm gonna give him a chance. I'm gonna give him a chance. All right. I'm eating. All right. Taking little kid with me. All right. All right. Okay. I'm, I'm... What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> what's going on? What's, what's happening? What's happening? What? 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 Nothing happened. <laughs> what? I don't know what they're talking about. His hands turned into fucking tentacles. <laughs> fucking dying. What? I don't know what they're talking about. All we do is hunt. I think we need a hug again. I don't know what. <laughs> The truce hug goes about as well as you can expect, and that's something that ends up repeating itself throughout multiple other videos in my adventures in VR chat and around Evolved Dant, as I'm sure you can probably guess. And then, the video I watched that got me into VR chat. Well, without even letting him know that I already knew who he was, without mentioning anything about him, keeping all of this information that I have lore dumped onto you internalized, it happens. Hey. 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 <laughs> oh dear. The thing activated blush and then motion <laughs> <I> can't do <laughs> It's so weird. <laughs> I don't do well with the last minutes. <laughs> I'm not even in VR, but it okay. even looks so for me. There you go. Oh my god. <laughs> the whole time I was just freaking the fuck out just in my own head because I couldn't believe that that scene was happening again and happening to me. At the same time, I was freaking the fuck out because when things get in my face in VR, I freaked the fuck out. Oh god. And then after that, he decided to quiz me. Another thing that would repeat itself for many videos to come. Oh my god, I still hear this to this day. My own viewers still to this day and my friends just always. Let's quiz you on that. I fucking look at it. Look at this thing that hasn't stopped for the rest of my life because of one day. It's amazing how one day can change your life. It's, it really is. An exciting person, I'll give you that. <laughs> Am I really? Yes. Let's quiz you on that. What? Oh no. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. What? Question number one. <laughs> what? How many polygons is your avatar? Is it less than 20k? Yes. That is correct. Yay! Oh, well, okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> Next question Is there a cat behind you? Yes. You looked. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't say I couldn't look. Now we're going on to the difficult questions. Okay. What happened when I gave you a truce hug? Your arms went all weird, apparently. Is that your final answer? They, they got, like, long and elastic. Right. Is yes. that your final answer? Yes. <laughs> yes, oh, excellent. Okay. Now for the final question. Is my avatar male or female? Oh shit. Female. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> um excuse can I look, me. Can I look at it? Like from all <laughs> angles? Yes. Okay. 99% uh, it's a male. You can friend you can uh call a friend. Call a friend? Can I do that? So, uh, yes, I don't yes you can. <laughs> That's how the game works. Alright, I'm calling Leroy. 
So, <laughs> so all right, Leroy, Leroy. One finger if it's a boy, two if it's a girl. That, that's five oh, fingers. Oh, wait. <laughs> Hold on, let me help you here. <laughs> Are you my mommy? Oh, Jesus Christ, that what scared the, the crap out of me. So, you're telling me you're either like a really tall girl or like a just a boy with a high voice? Hey, 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 hey. That's a two and a one. Five? Was it both? Is it both? What, what does five mean? You have a mic, Leroy. I know you do. <laughs> so both. Oh, time's up. You gotta answer this question now. Is it both? Both. I don't. Wait, is that I, your I don't know, answer? Leroy's... I don't know. I'm gonna go with both. Fuck it. Oh shit! <laughs> what? <laughs> it's ambiguous. It's ambiguous. Okay. <laughs> what did that have to do with whether or not you're an exciting person? Why do I have to answer? I don't understand. What, what does that have to do with anything? Because I said that, and then you said, Okay, let me quiz you. Okay. Good question. Let me quiz you. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Question number one. You... Oh. Is your avatar less than 20,000 polygons? We just did this! <laughs> no. Yes, it is! It's Correct! Not... We did just do this. Oh Next my question. God. <laughs> I swear to God, it's about that fucking cat this again. It's like you passed the first test. <laughs> Sorry, right? This is. This question is worth $1. One dollar. What? One penny. What happens when you rub the lamp? A scary ass motherfucker comes out and chases me. Oh, 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 So after something like two, three hours of a mixture of shenanigans and him leaving the world and coming back. At the very end of all of this in this video, I went up to him filled with anxiety, which I mean, I'm always filled with anxiety, but you know, extra anxiety. I went up to him and I told him, you know, thanks for showing me VR chat, although in a far less composed way with a little bit of stuttering and feeling like I was gonna cry. Originally, I just wanted to say, hey, you're neat. I saw you on YouTube. You're the reason why I played this game. Thanks for d doing that, even though you didn't intentionally do that. That was it. Same. Okay. Same. Well, thank you. That I I hear that a lot, so it's cool. It's always nice to know that people are introduced to the game from the stuff that I do. Oh. Yeah. Cool. Look. Thank I you. Don't even know him. Have, have, have a good night. Um, All right. You too. Night. Good night, everyone. Yeah. See ya. See ya. See ya. Until next time. Not until next time. Because we were this next time we're gonna be nice. We're all gonna be good. And that was the video that introduced Evolved Ant into my channel where I met Evolved Ant, where Evolved Ant became one of the most frequent and most important characters in my videos. That became my most popular video for a long time. There you have it. But that's not the end of this story. Anyway, literally the next time I saw Evolved Ant, I was just minding my own business and I turned around and suddenly- OH MY GOD! Why are you like... Nose booping. Uh -oh. While invisible. Uh oh. Oh, son of a bitch. No! Oh! <laughs> God damn. God damn. It didn't even bother me till the music kicked on. <laughs> Stop making that sound! <laughs> I just don't... Oh, now you're a floating tomato. Oh, this creepy shit happens over there. Shy, don't run over to me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. 
Whoa, whoa! Yo, go up to shy! Anyway, we already covered most of the important stuff, so I'm not gonna go over this entire video. If you wanna look it up yourself, it's called Evolved Ant Makes Me Cry, but I'll at least tell you the title part. At the very end, he's in a tent, and I kind of like phase through <laughs> the wall. <laughs> just kind of be like boo but I don't say boo I just go like hey and uh, he reacts and his reaction just makes me start laughing so hard that I start fucking crying hey I'm just like what are you a ghost you have to do walls over here <laughs> <laughs> like everyone else came to the front and you decide no I can just go through walls I'll just come from behind <laughs> You didn't even just do it like, oh, just walk real quick. No, you literally just slowly came through. Yeah, at least Systems has a, an avatar that makes sense for going through walls. And that video was about a month later, roughly, kind of. And then the next one that he appeared in was actually more like months later, I believe. My own VR continuity in my videos is hard to keep track of, especially since I split it into two playlists, which I'll, I'll cover in a different uh, video. But this next one's called Evolved Ant Loves Lollies. And in it, you know, he's doing his quizzes. Those quizzes are still going. And we entered lolly land where everyone was just a lolly and then later about two and a half minutes into the video a joke comes up that well it portrays him as liking matt nine and this became another really long-term joke in the videos and this is where it's from wow you look pretty attractive in this picture <laughs> oh it's just in ant likes lollies that's not a lolly in the picture, it looks older though. Wait, make the, make oh, the picture yeah, again. yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, suddenly it's like lolly and then suddenly it looks like a teenager. That's a lolly. I'm imagining things. How is that? Bit, what? That's a lolly. It does look a little bit older. Oh. <laughs> it's not older, that's just taller. This is, this is a lolly? It's not. Ah. Hi, hi, hi. Ah. <laughs> Someone put their hand in front. No one's caught blocked in this. In a video. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, now this one, this one's a lot older, and you'll love it. Look up. <laughs> Look up. Oh See? my gosh. Hey, what do you mean I don't love it? it? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> <laughs> you said that it was attractive. Yeah, are you saying it's not? Well, then why wouldn't you love it if you thought it is? Lolly fun. Yeah, Lolly fun. Mine's the one with the big tail. <laughs> above me with that. <laughs> hey, uh, it's, it's your biggest fan. Did you? Behind, uh, right, right over here. It's your biggest fan. Wait, what? <laughs> what? They're going behind me! No! <laughs> <laughs> she wants that booty. I can't believe you fell for that. Oh! 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rizula. Oh, I really wish I'm I gonna have to make a new avatar to mess with you now. You're gonna <laughs> pay for this. <laughs> <laughs> and this video was actually recorded in Evolved Ant's Disney Firework World, which at the time was private. He only invited a couple individuals to come in and see it. I think it's public now, and I think it's different and more extravagant. I think I had to mute some of it due to copyright restrictions, and that's a video in itself. During the same video and during this same day, Evolved Ant actually decided to take me on a little tour of his Sword Art Online world that he was making. I don't. It wasn't out at the time, 
But and I got to bring whoever I really wanted, and anyone around me was invited to come check it out as well. He showed us around with some shenanigans, and that was a fun time. And we had a lot of videos set there. I think one of Shy's most popular videos with me in it takes place in that world. Yes, you can go first. All right. Whoa. Oh, that's so cool. What? Whoa, that's trippy. Holy crap. We don't that's need this kind of a swell. Oof. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that's cheating. <laughs> that's cheating. <laughs> Uh, As you cheater, there's no guns in this. You're a hacker. Bloody spies. Hacker. It says, "All ye who stand here, as a pair, shall be married for eternity." Whoa. No, However, I'm not going to do anything. Those who stand on top of the stone itself shall, in his worthiness, be purged. Of all audio bugs. Oh. <laughs> I'm too I'm on sunshine. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Got to hit myself there. <laughs> okay, so in the updated uh, version of this I world, the, you can actually go in the water here. So temporary issue. I'm in the water yeah. right now. Here, wherever you are. Okay, this is going too weird. <laughs> so, you do right, like Lolly. It's, it's never weird enough. Okay, for what? VR what? Are you I'm just playing here. Why? Why are you in this game, to... like vistas <laughs> <laughs> or something? Here, we have games. the best view I'm in the game. Ninety-nine and of this, them. This is like the uh, the romantic spot where you could take someone if you want to go on like a date in VR chat with someone. I can't go into these houses because right that would have been cool if you could. Because you have like this beautiful scenery, birds flying, and now I have music, an audio glitch. Got those waterfalls off in the distance. Yep, the waterfalls. It's the perfect spot to bring someone on a date. And a well. You know, what? I always wondered. What? Would it be overpowered powered if they had firearms in Sword Art Online, like, like a gun, like a you know, like they a musket? have guns in. What? Did you watch yeah. the anime? Yeah, yeah, but I mean, like the first season. Not Gun Gal That's... Online. You know what? That reminds me of a thing I was wondering. Wouldn't it be overpowered if they have like atomic bombs in the first season? <laughs> Like, what's the, like, what's the point of that? Where is the point of that question? It's like... <laughs> yes, it would be hey, overpowered Alan. to have guns in a fantasy I game with swords. I've never yeah, seen so Ant what? get sarcastic. So here we have a, a level 3 boar. And as you can see, a mat 9 is not high enough level to even damage it. Oh! Um, oh! It's oh! It's not adorable. attacking us. What? It's not. You gotta kill him with the slimes first. He's a too high level for you. Look, even I can't kill him. It's. Oh, I'm, I'm going to go this thing oh. now. I'm a monk. Why do you have a sword and shield on your back then? <laughs> uh, are you, <laughs> are you milking the boy? <laughs> are you. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to remove these and replace them with something else now. What are you doing? Are you milking Azula? <laughs> <laughs> Stop! Oh, there's a chest! Wait, a chest? I never noticed the chest. Internet. Break it open! We need a key for Inside this. Inside this chest contains. The bug fix for the audio bug. <laughs> but you have to find the key. And the key is inside my heart. Kill him. 
Okay. Kill him! Kill him! Kill him! Go get him! Kill end him! Kill him already! End him! No. Rip it out! Not that kind of it's not physically there. I remember that video was on a stage, which conveniently enough, in like the next big video I posted about Evolved Ant, it starts out on that stage with Matt Nine trying to give a speech, but he's mute, so Evolved Ant is interpreting for him. Now we can discuss strategy. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Matt, Matt Nine does this every time. Strategy. I'll be the interpreter. First, you must add the butter and the eggs to the batter, and then you must mix it. Once you mix it, you now have your cake mix. You need to shove the cake mix into the oven, and then make sure that you preheat the oven low to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. And watch an season two. Season two of Netflix is an episode of Stranger Things. While okay, stop cooking. now. You're bad at this. Okay, I have the correct uh, information here. Alright, so, alright, let's hear it. The first thing we need to do is be aware that the boss has three three phases to the fight. What, what? Are you trying to cut the cheese over wait, here? Wait, 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 like, wait, wait, wait. Two, two things, two things. Number one, uh, which direction is the boss? That way, that, okay. And number two, keep going, keep going, keep going. So, the boss has three... Yeah? Has three phases. In phase one... LEROY! And this video was actually recorded on the same day, and I remember the looter Matt and I and Wife and I and God, I remember Ant started going on a little rant, I think like four minutes into this video, the cock block in VR video, about how he tried to start things off nice. Uh, oh. Uh, your, your, your wife is kissing uh, another okay. man. Okay. What else is happening? Same. That. Hey! <laughs> oh my god. You know, I tried to start this off nice with some Disney, some sort of online. I and now we're just gonna go to Doom. Fucking Peter Pan. Immediately after that scene came the cock blocked in VR scene. Now this was that kiss me moment. But on my side, instead of Pokelol's side, but with a cock block, but that cock block had a catch this time. It was truly a reenactment, but missing somebody as the Unity Chan. Now this video didn't do nearly as well as the real big important one that reached 100k. Currently it's only sitting at 20 and a half thousand views, but that scene I used as an intro and I uh, used it in some death scenes and like maybe cute compilations, I forget. But I recycled that scene quite a bit throughout my content and I think that's one of my favorite and most important scenes with Evolved Ant and that took place in a Doom world, funny enough, which recently I actually played the original Rage on my Twitch channel and I saw that world as an Easter egg. I was like, oh hey, I remember this scene from that. And now that we've gotten to that scene, that's where I'm gonna stop the play reel of videos that I've been showing you. Now you've seen the process leading up to meeting Evolved Ant, how Evolved Ant got me into VR chat, more specifically going in depth on what I talked about at the start of this series. You've seen how I got to know Evolved Ant and how hanging out with him had become more normalized and you've heard a lot of behind the scenes stuff that doesn't appear in the videos. I could go on and on and on showing you footage about Evolved Ant because he stays in my videos literally until my final videos I ever made on VR chat. I think he was in the last one, if not within the last three. Evolved Ant was a very important character and person in VR chat, in my VR chat videos, in my experiences, in my life. This man, just by happenstance of doing what he did, quite literally changed my life forever. Matt Nine and Wife Nine actually went to Disneyland once and met him. That's just a little extra fun fact, but I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed learning about the past and behind the scenes of these events and learning about Evolved Ant as a character. Let me know if there's any topics you want to hear me discuss in this format from the VR chat videos or if there's any just 
base scam videos you want to see me do in general. I'll take all kinds of suggestions. A big thank you to everyone who financially supports this channel. You're the reason that I can keep doing what I'm doing, streaming on Twitch, uploading videos here. If you also want to support, all links are in the description. You can join as a channel member on YouTube. You can become a patron over on Patreon. And there's something very similar over on Gilded, which is where we host our community server, which you can find in the description below as well, if you want to hang out with us, or even join us in multiplayer games that you see me playing here on Twitch. Supporters get access to deleted scenes and uncut videos, and even entire deleted videos videos from VR chat and more, and a weekly shout out of which this video will end displaying the names of all the current patrons while I'm making this video. And that's all I have for today, so thank you guys very much for being here and watching, and I'll see you on the next one.